Hello and welcome to my third progress video of my old school Iron Man account. In this episode we do a lot of skilling for quests, so uh, let's get right into it. First of all, I start the Limbridge Diary. I sold myself some steel plate legs and got myself up to 10k. With the 10k I bought myself runes, uh, because I wanted to camp at the fire giants to try and get myself that rune scimitar. A fire battle step drop, very nice but I already have the rune scimitar. Thirty-seven magic, so now we can teleport to Valador. After that, I sold all my loot for five k. Here you can see I killed the Warlord or for the Tree Gnome Village quest. It's actually pretty easy to be honest. And done. So I got myself. 36 attack as a reward, that's very nice. I decided to train my agility for the Grand Tree quest uh, until level 25. After that I bought myself some law runes because then it will be easy to teleport around the world. Well, I got myself a random event again, and I got myself a crap reward. Die, demon! Die! Here we go, done. Very easy. Let's go finish this quest. Here we go, bam! 31 agility. 41 attack and 41 magic. Very nice. After that I decided to do the dog task. I got a lot of levels from the dog task even though the task really sucked. First slayer task completed, let's get ourselves a new one. Vaneka, give me a task. Hill Giants, oh, amazing, it's really good XP. Well, I don't want to forget the key because else I have to walk all the way around. Over here I got myself a cosmic rune drop and that's actually very useful for later. And BAM! 20 Slayer. Mission accomplished. Well, let's get ourselves a new task. Uh, Ice Warriors. Well, before we do that, I'm gonna get myself uh, my very first clue scroll. Well, I got it very fast, after 4 tries already, and uh, the first task is actually pretty easy. BAM! And another clue. Well this clue is actually annoying, because uh, I need 18 crafting to make my own leather chaps, so I gotta do that. First I bought myself the Gnome items, and uh, then I decided to do quests to get my levels up. Uh, I did Murder Mystery, and it gave me 11 crafting, that's very nice. 
and after that I did the observatory quest what gave me 18 crafting and also 1k XP for attack very nice I bought myself some crafting items for later uh, and of course over here I make myself the chaps yay Okay, let's spin, talk, and another casket, and another clue. Uh, well, this is actually pretty easy. Talk, and another clue. Also very easy. And bam! Uh, not the best reward, but at least I train my skills a bit. Uh, now I'm gonna train my crafting for the last city quest uh, because I want to get, get that out of the way. I need 31 crafting and 36 woodcutting for that. Got myself another random event and got myself a tooth health of a key. Very nice! Here we go, let's collect some flax. 20 crafting, very nice. Here we go, 31 crafting. Uh, let's check how many bow strings we made. Nine hundred. Uh, that's very nice. Uh, well, now I'm gonna get my wood cutting up to level thirty six so I can do the last city quest. Got myself another random event and very nice loot. I got myself five rupees. Amazing. Here we go. 36 wood cutting. Uh, let's check our bank and see what we got. Uh, I'm probably gonna f quickly fletch my logs and see which level I get. And then I'm good to go. Bam, she's dead. Very easy. Let's make ourselves the staff. And the quest completed. Also very easy and also pretty damn short. Well, this was my third Iron Man Proc video. Hope you all enjoyed. I did a lot in this video, uh, even though it's kind of short. I'll try to make it a bit longer later. Uh, anyway, I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video of Revolve Make. See ya!